When I was elected, I said I would always be honest with you. So today, I want to take a few moments to talk about the new COVID variant first identified last week in Southern Africa. It's called the Omicron. The very day the World Health Organization identified the new variant, I took immediate steps to restrict travel from countries in Southern Africa. But while we have that travel restrictions can slow the speed of Omicron, it cannot prevent it. But here's what it does. It gives us time. It gives us time to take more actions. When you diminish or stop or block travel from a particular country, yeah. there's a reason for that. It's to give you time to do things. Hey, Mr. President, what's your message to Americans who are trying to get tested now and who are not able to get tested and who are wondering what took so long to ramp up testing? Come on, what took so long? I'm hearing that from people who are trying to get tested now before the holidays. Well, what took so long it didn't take long at all. Look, remember what I said we put the travel ban on is to see how much time we had before it hit here so we could begin to decide what we needed. If you go to the pharmacy, we hear this over and over again, empty shelves, no test kits. Is that a failure? No, I don't think it's a failure. So are, are you talking about gatherings with people who are had both vaccinations, both shots and the booster? That's the safest thing you can do, both shots and the booster. Marin County's health officer says all of the guests at this indoor event were vaccinated. Many were boosted and still 28 people came down with COVID-19. Nearly half of the people who attended got COVID, even with vaccination and testing requirements to attend. When I was elected, I said I would always be honest. I've no more fucks to give. My fucks have run up dry.